In a world where nations were divided by their bending abilities, a young air nomad named Aang discovered that he was the long-lost avatar destined to master all four elements and bring balance to the world. Accompanied by his loyal friends Katara, Sokka, and the flying bison Appa, Aang set out on a thrilling adventure to fulfill his destiny. One day, as the group journeyed through the Earth Kingdom, they stumbled upon a small village facing an unusual problem. The village's river had mysteriously dried up, leaving the crops and the spirits of the villagers withering away. Aang, always eager to help, decided to investigate, the village elder, a wise woman named Lao, explained that a group of earthbenders had diverted the river's flow for their own benefit, leaving the village in peril. Ping, determined to right the wrong, promised to restore the river's flow and bring prosperity back to the village. Guided by Katara's waterbending, Aang and the gang traced the river's path and confronted the rogue earthbenders. These earthbenders, led by a stubborn young man named Haru, believed that their actions were necessary for survival. Ping, empathizing with their struggles, proposed a different solution, to work together in finding a sustainable way to share the river's resources. As Aang mediated between the villagers and the earthbenders, Sokka devised a plan to construct a series of canals that would distribute the water evenly, benefiting both groups. The cooperative effort not only restored the river's flow, but also fostered understanding between the villagers and the earthbenders. In gratitude, the village invited Aang and his friends to a festive celebration. The once divided community now united, celebrating the power of cooperation and compromise. Aang, recognizing that balance extended beyond bending elements, left the village with a valuable lesson that unity and understanding could overcome even the most challenging obstacles. Continuing their journey, Aang and his friends encountered more communities in need. Whether it was mediating between feuding tribes, helping oppressed villages, or thwarting the plans of the menacing Fire Nation, Aang's compassion and diplomacy proved to be as powerful as his bending abilities throughout their adventures. Aang's friends played crucial roles. Katara's waterbending healed both physical and emotional wounds, Sokka's clever strategies saved the day, and Appa's loyal presence provided a comforting anchor in times of trouble. As Aang progressed in mastering the elements, he carried the spirit of cooperation and unity with him. The journey wasn't just about defeating the Fire Nation, but about teaching the world that different nations could coexist in harmony. In the end, Aang faced the Fire Lord, Ozai, in a battle that would determine the fate of the world. Drawing upon the lessons learned during their travels, Aang found a way to defeat Ozai without taking his life, upholding the values of compassion and justice. The last airbender's journey, marked by friendship, growth, and the pursuit of balance, became legendary. Ping, along with his friends, reshaped the world, proving that even the mightiest elements could bow to the power of unity and understanding.